guys, <clears throat> today we're going to discuss tumbler prepping. Now, my biggest thing that I've been thinking about this time of year is with winter coming and not having a place to spray paint my tumblers white, especially for when I'm using um, white glitter. I was trying to figure out what my best options would be, would be since I can't spray paint in the house because of the fumes. So I tried something and came up with this really cool technique. Um, I went to Walmart and bought a 97 cent thing of paint, of the craft paint. You guys can see that. And my favorite go-to paintbrush. Now this actually worked really well. You want to cover your tumbler, tumbler like really well. And you do definitely want to do a couple of coats of this. The best thing about this paint is too, it also dries really fast. And smooth it out as best as you can. You want to make sure you get the whole cup all the way up to the rim and try not to get it in the rim of the cup but even if you do this paint washes off very easily Now once you get a nice good coat on here, you want to let this dry for a while and then put a second coat on. You want to make sure you don't see as much as that stainless steel through. Now after you get a couple of coats on here, I suggest two or three coats. Make sure you're letting them dry really well. And after you do, you're able, without sealing this, you can actually do um, glitter the epoxy method. When I use the white glitter, I always use, I always do two coats of it. It makes it look nicer. Um, you don't see as much, you won't see as much through it. I do have one here, set this off to the side, dry, I do have one here that I did do this method, just down a little bit, this one has three coats of the acrylic white craft paint on it. And then two coats of the glitter done epoxy method. And it turned out beautiful. It's ready for my first coat of epoxy over this. And then after that, I can start doing my designs. Our next video, I will show you after I have a couple of coats on the other tumbler, I will show you how good it holds up when you put the epoxy over it without being sealed. 
make sure to hit the subscribe button to our channel so you don't miss that. Thank you guys for viewing and I will see you later.